with the huge amount of steak that we had left last night after my husband went hog wild in the beef section of Meyer. It only seemed natural to do steak and eggs this morning for breakfast. So I have two and a half ounces of steak there. I weighed it out. And then I have my eggs. This has some fresh bell pepper and onion. It was all out of my pepper and onion blend, so I actually had to chop this morning. I was not happy about it. Um, and then I never add cheese to my eggs, but I did today because it fit the whole, like, Philly cheese steak vibe I was going with. So I have a little bit of cheddar cheese in there. Um, and that's breakfast this morning. Yum. Oh, you guys, I haven't really checked in because I have been nursing a toothache all day. I think a piece of that steak I ate got lodged between my teeth and it just, it's so painful. So I went in with floss and tried to remove it and I just irritated my gums and now they really hurt. So <sighs> other than that, dental pain is by far the worst pain. Um, other than that, Hubby and I sat down today while he was home. Um, typically he goes hunting first thing in the morning, then he comes home for a couple of hours in the afternoon before he heads back out for the evening hunt. So whilst he was home, we were sitting down and kind of discussing what our financial goals for 2021 are. I want to um, sit down and film a 2021 financial goals video. So I was kind of talking with him and that got us to talking about like a five-year plan and what we want for our future. Um, we're talking about buying land so that we can either build a house or um, do like a modular home or, you know, we have lots of different options, but we started talking about what we wanted in land, which led us to then search for land in our area. And then we went on a little drive and looked around at some um, different plots of land that were available. Obviously, we're not buying right now um, because we are still in debt and we want to make sure we get our debt paid off and get ourselves in a good financial situation before we do that. Um, this home that we live in now is a single wide mobile home and so it's not something that we can necessarily move onto land in the future. So then we were trying to decide what we wanted to do with this place long term, if we want to keep it um, or if we want to sell and buy something else. And that just led us down this whole long, like, what our future looks like talk, which is fun to think about and talk about, but also a little depressing because we can't make big moves towards our future until we pay off our past sins. So we still have credit card debt that we're working on and um, probably have another year before we are out of debt, providing that everything continues to go well for us financially could be even longer if things go south so sort of in two minds about it but it's definitely fun to think about our future and where we're gonna go next so that's basically all we've done I am going to go and take some pain medication for this tooth some Tylenol and maybe catch up on some vlogmas videos because I'm definitely behind on watching all of my friends vlogmas videos and um just some other fun YouTubers that I watch. So I think that's how I'm going to spend my afternoon. We're just having leftovers for dinner. Um, slash like fend for yourself type thing. So I don't have to cook. Could be doing laundry and housework. But I don't think I'm going to. I think I'm going to let future Jesse worry about that. And I'm just going to relax. You guys, I'm so sorry that I have not filmed anything today. It is almost 9pm. And I think I've only filmed one clip. There just was not a whole heck of a lot going on today, so this is probably the shortest vlog yet, but yesterday's vlog was relatively long, so maybe it kind of makes up the difference? I don't know. Anyway, we're going to open up the advent calendar today. I'm going to assume that whatever is in here is probably caffeinated and I won't be drinking it tonight, but I still wanted to share with you guys what the tea is for today. But I need to know what the date is. What's the date? 13th. 13th? Okay. We'll go with 13th. And the tea for today. Ooh. That's definitely caramel pieces in there. So this is... Oh! Salted caramel... 
oolong. I've never had an oolong tea before. I absolutely love the look of them because the leaves always unfurl really beautifully, but I've never actually had one. But salted caramel is like my favorite flavor ever. So let's just check caffeine content because if this is not highly caffeinated, I'm gonna drink this tonight. All right, salted caramel oolong or caramel, however you say it. I actually say it both ways, just depends on, I don't know what. Sometimes I say caramel, sometimes I say caramel. Always say it's delicious. So it says it's only got one dot of caffeine, so I'm gonna go ahead and have this right now. And it's got oolong tea, caramel bits, sugar crystals, a pineapple, uh, carob, chicory root, artificial caramel flavoring, and salt. So I'm definitely going to steep this up right now and have this. Okay, so given that this does have caffeine, I only made eight ounces worth of tea because I don't need to consume that much caffeine right before bed, but look at how beautiful this is. Oh, of course it's all fogged up. Let's go ahead and get it in a cup. I cannot wait to try this. I anticipate really liking this. But yeah, look at how beautiful those used tea leaves are. Oolong tea is so pretty. There, it's fogged up again. <laughs> oh, I can't even not even begin to tell you guys how good this smells. Oh, if it tastes even half as good as it smells, it's going to be amazing. It smells like caramel. Yes. Will you hold the camera while I do a taste test? We're gonna do a quick taste test, it's hot. I am still wearing yesterday's shirt. I've worn it all day. Oh, yeah, it's good. Um, so I guess oolong tea does have a very um, unique flavor, but the caramel's taste is there. It's really good. I like this one a lot. definitely recommend this one, especially if you know you like oolong tea. All right, you guys, I'm going to go ahead and say goodnight now. You want to hold the camera straight, Robert? It's kind of crooked. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching today. Sorry for the shorter vlog. I will definitely be back tomorrow with hopefully some more footage, a lot more stuff to share with you. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Happy Vlogmas!